Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to show you my Disney Movie Club collection, so stay tuned. So I recently had a request to show my Disney Movie Club collection, so I thought I would take today to show you all of that. This right here will include DVDs, um, special edition DVDs, um, Blu-rays, and special edition Blu-rays. So first up, I'm going to go ahead and go over some of my um, DVD releases, and I will give you the dates that these were released. So first up, we have DuckTales, which was released January 1st, 2006. Now this right here was a hard one to come by and a lot of people really wanted to have this one added to the collection and I really do love the um, animation on this DuckTales movie so that's the first one. Second one we have The Treasures of um, Matakumbe which was, which was released May 2007. Never actually seen this one but I've heard a lot of good things about it so I added that one to the collection. Okay, we have Polly. Polly was released February 12, 2008, and um, as you can see, it's a version of Pollyanna. Now, I do remember seeing this one on the Disney Channel way back when, and very happy to have that one. And they actually did have a sequel, which came out the same day, um, Polly Coming Home, February 12, 2008. So, very nice to have that one in the collection. Okay, another, another classic is So Dear to My Heart. Now this right here was released July 1st, 2008. It's the classic animation style, kind of similar to, um, I guess, Song of the South and um, I guess Bedknobs and Broomsticks, Mary Poppins, you know, just where the animation is mixed in with live action. Okay, next up we have The Incredible Journey. This right here was released September the 23rd, 2008 and really good classic Disney movie. Really enjoyed this one. Okay, and then another DVD is Escape to Florence. Now Escape to Florence was released September 16th, 2013. And of course, um, as you can see, it does feature Annette Funicello, a classic Disney Mouseketeer. Okay, another good one is A Coyote Goes to Hollywood. I really do like the um, stories that feature around animals. And so this right here is another good one. This right here came out in December 2013, I do believe. Okay. The next one is The Hardy Boys in The Mystery of the Applegate Treasure. I really do enjoy the Hardy Boys TV series, part of the um, Mickey Mouse Club. And this right here came out in May on May 15th, 2014. And I do have the Hardy Boys TV show in the Disney um, Treasures collection. Okay, next up is Mr. Boogity and the Bride of Boogity 2 movie collection. Now this right here came out in August 2015. I believe this right here is a classic Disney Channel, um, two classic movies from the Disney Channel that I've never seen. A lot of people have a lot of good fond memories of that. Okay, a more recent one from October 8, 2019 is The Thanksgiving Promise. Um, I've never seen this one, but this right here looks like something that would be right up my alley. Um, just a good family, wholesome family movie. So I was very happy that they added that one to the collection. Okay, so the next titles I'm going to show you are some of the classic animated shows that were featured from the Disney Movie Club. We got Darkwing Duck. It's a Wonderful Leaf. And this right here is from October 21st, 2008. And of course features um, the Disney Channel Darkwing Duck character. So I added that to the collection. Then we have the Goof Troop, Have Yourself a Goofy Little Christmas, October 21st, 2008. So very nice classic um, Goofy type animation from the Goof Troops. And a more recent release is DuckTales Volume 4. So this right here was the only way that you were able to finish the DuckTales um, collection. It includes all 25 episodes. Now this right here was released September 11, 2018. And um, I did do an unboxing of all of the classic shows from this um, release. Of course there's no disc art. But people were very happy to finally finish their DuckTales collection. 
Okay, next up I'm going to show you some exclusives from the Disney Movie Club that might just be um, a DVD sleeve or a box set. Um, we did get The Rescuers um, with a nice slip cover. This right here was a Disney Movie Club exclusive. Really like the artwork on this one. And it's nice to have a slip cover for this edition. And then we got the Jungle Book 2 movie collection. So really nice looking artwork. As you can see, it's, it's um, debossed. Very nice looking, nice looking packaging. The back is not so, you know, nothing really special about the back. And then it did just include um, the Jungle Book 2 and the Jungle Book when the Platinum Edition came out. So nice to have this one in the collection. Another set similar to that was the Fox and the Hound 25th Anniversary Collection. So this right here was another um, packaging, as you can see, that has the Disney Movie Club at the bottom. It's the Best of Friends Collection with the window. And it, of course, includes um, the 25th Anniversary Edition of the Fox and the Hound with the sleeve and the Fox and the Hound 2. So this right here is what they called the Best of Friends collection, which is really nice to have that one in the collection also. Okay, next up is some other really nice packaging, and that is for the 101 Dalmatians Ultimate 4 Movie Collection. Really like the box art on this one, which wraps all the way around. And as you can tell, you do have some animated Dalmatians, and you also have some live action um, Dalmatians. And the reason for that is because of what was released. So we do have the 101 Dalmatians Platinum Edition DVD. This really nice slip cover. 101 Dalmatians 2 with a slip. 101 Dalmatians, the live action version, which is really hard to come by. So nice to have that one with a sleeve and 102 Dalmatians with a sleeve. So very nice to have that one in the collection. Okay, next up I'm gonna show you the Blu-ray collection for the Disney Movie Club exclusives. Um, the first releases of these actually came with slip covers. So I am gonna do these by release date and give you the date that these were released. So first up we have the Apple Dumpling Gang 40th Anniversary Edition. This right here was released on September 9th, 2014. I really do enjoy this movie, so very nice to have this one added to the collection. I really do enjoy Don Knotts and Tim Conway in this, and um, just a really fun movie to watch. Okay, next up we have the Computer War Tennis Shoes. This is the 45th Anniversary Edition from September 9th, 2014. Never actually seen this one. Recently I have not seen this one. I seen it a long time ago, and so nice to have that one. Now this right here is the Love Bug, Herbie um, the Love Bug, 45th Anniversary Edition from December 16th, 2014. I actually saw this one in the theater when it was released and have a lot of good fond memories of seeing this one in the theater with my family. Okay, next up we have Herbie Rides Again, the 40th Anniversary Edition from December 2nd, 2014. So another great edition. Another classic is Old Yeller from February 10th, 2015. I've actually only seen this movie once. I really need to watch it again. Um, but it's nice to have this classic Disney film on Blu-ray. Okay, the next one is Pollyanna from the 55th Anniversary Edition. This right here was released February 10th, 2015 with a nice slip cover. I do enjoy Pollyanna. It's another classic Disney film. Okay, now this is where they quit doing the sleeves, unfortunately, but we do get Return to Oz, the 30th Anniversary Edition, released April 14th, 2015. Um, really nice artwork on this one. It would have been nice to have a slipcover, but I do remember seeing this movie. It is a lot um, scarier, I would say, than the original Wizard of Oz. This is a nice continuation, a lot of nice characters. So, very, very happy to have this one in the collection. Okay, next up we have the Swiss Family Robinson. This is for the 55th Anniversary Edition, released April 14th, 2015. Really classic Disney um, movie. 
So very happy to have that one on Blu-ray. Then we continue with the Herbie uh, movies. We have Herbie Goes to Monte Carlo from um, June 30th, 2015 was the release for this Blu-ray. We have Herbie Goes Bananas. This right here is for the 35th anniversary edition. And this right here was released June 30th, 2015. Now these, these two movies um, are, are good Herbie movies, but they're not as good as the first two. Um, but it still is very nice to have these in, these in the collection. Okay, here are the next two movies I'm going to show you are really great classic Disney movies. We have Escape to Witch Mountain. This right here was released for the 40th anniversary edition and released on October the 13th, 2015. Really nice looking artwork. And on the same day, they released um, Return from Witch Mountain. So very nice to have both of those films in my Disney collection. Okay, next up we have another classic Disney um, film and that is Treasure Island. Now this right here was released for the 65th anniversary um, and it was released on November the 10th, 2015. So very good. Okay, this right here is another great set of movies. We have the um, Davy Crockett, King of the Wall Frontier and Davy Crockett and the River Pirates 2 movie collection. This right here was released for the 60th anniversary edition on November the 10th, 2015. So very nice to have these two films on Blu-ray. Okay, next up we have Blackbeard's Ghost. Now this right here is another one that I saw in the theater when it was released. And this right here was re-released on Blu-ray on January 5th, 2016. It's a pretty good movie. If you haven't seen it, um, definitely check that one out. Okay, we have the classic, The Absent-Minded Professor. This right here was released for the 55th anniversary, and it was released on March 1st, 2016. So a great um, Fred McMurray film. Okay, we have Operation Dumbo Drop. Now this right here is for the 20th anniversary, and it was released on April 26, 2016. So nice to have this one. I haven't seen this one in a very long time, so I am uh, very happy to have that one in the collection. Okay, the next one is The Boat Nicks. Now The Boat Nicks is, um, this right here was released for the 45th anniversary edition, and this was released on June 21st, um, 2016. I've never actually seen this film, and I never actually had this one in the collection. Um, and it is opened, and it just has a plain disc, which a majority, I think all of these actually just have a, a plain Blu-ray disc. But anyways, it's nice to have this one finally in the collection. I missed out when this was released from the Disney Movie Club, and I ended up having to get this one on eBay. So this right here does keep my collection for the Blu-rays at 100%. Okay, next up we have Son of Flubber. Now, Son of Flubber was released on August 16th, 2016. Another um, black and white classic with Fred McMurray. I don't actually remember seeing this movie, uh, but I really do enjoy these classics. Okay, the next one is Monkeys Go Home. Now, Monkeys Go Home was released on Blu-ray on October the 11th, 2016. We have The Strongest Man in the World. This right here is um, for the 40, 40th anniversary edition and it was released on December the, December the 6th, 2016. We have The Last Flight of Noah's Ark. This right here is for the 35th anniversary and it was released on January 31st, 2017. I've never actually seen this movie before, but it looks like a classic Disney film. Okay, now this next movie is a great movie. I really do enjoy this one, and it is Cool Runnings. So, Cool Runnings was released on March 28th, 2017. Great film. If you've never seen this one, I would highly recommend you check that one out. Okay, these next set of movies that I've got um, were all released during the same time. So, I'm going to show you all of these together. We have Mighty Ducks. Now, all three of these were, were released on Blu-ray on May 23rd, 2017. So we have Mighty Ducks, D2, The Mighty Ducks, and D3, The Mighty Ducks. So very nice to have those all in my collection. I really do enjoy The Mighty Ducks films. And then these next two movies, 
we have Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Now this right here was released on July 18th, 2017. Really great film, or fun film. And also Honey, I Blew Up the Kid was released on the same day. So these both came out on July 18th, 2017. Okay, next up we do have Jungle to Jungle. This right here was released for the 20th anniversary and it was released on January 2nd, 2018. So this right here was back when Tim Allen was doing all of the Santa Claus movies. He also had this movie that came out. I never actually saw this one, um, but it's nice to have that one in the collection. Okay, we have Snow Dogs. Snow Dogs came out January 2nd, 2018. This is another one that I've never seen. Okay, we have, for the 75th anniversary, we have Saludos Amigos and the Three Caballeros. This right here um, was released on January 30th, 2018, and it's just a classic Disney animation. Okay, next up, we do have Rocket Man. Rocket Man was released for the 20th anniversary, and it was released on February 27th, 2018. This one I never saw. Um, I've never seen this one. It just seemed kind of goofy, probably because of the artwork on the front. Um, I just never saw this, but of course I wanted it in my collection. Okay, here's another fun movie to watch, and that is Mighty Joe Young. Now, Mighty Joe Young, was this right here was released for the 20th anniversary, and it was released on February 27th, 2018. So very nice having this one in the collection. Definitely recommend you checking this one out. Okay, we have... Two other classic Disney films. One's a classic and one's a remake. We have Freaky Friday. Now Freaky Friday was released um, March 27th, 2018. Now this right here is the one from um, 1976 and I do remember seeing this one in the theater when it came out. And then they did a remake right here. Um, this right here was released for the 15th anniversary. This right here is the 2003 film and was released on Blu-ray on March 27th, 2018. Of course, it has Jamie Lee Curtis and Lindsay Lohan in it. I do not think I've ever seen this one. This is another one that it has been opened up. And as you can see, it does have just the blue disc in it. So I definitely need to check this one out. It's been a long time. And then something similar to Freaky Friday um, that they did is we have the classic The Parent Trap. Now, The Parent Trap from 1961 was re-released on Blu-ray April 24th, 2018. And then on the same day, they released the remake with Lindsay Lohan and this one also. And this one has been open and just has the regular blue disc. Okay, another great film, if you've never seen this one, I would definitely recommend it, and that is The Three Musketeers. Now, The Three Musketeers, this right here was released for their 25th anniversary, and it was released on May 22nd, 2018. Very good film, I highly recommend this one. No discard on that one either. Okay, another classic, um, I say classic, another great film from Disney is Holes. Now this right here is for the 15th anniversary, and this right here was released on May 22nd, 2018. I did watch this one a couple of years ago for the first time and really enjoyed it. So definitely check that one out if you've never seen it. Okay, we have The Journey of Natty Gan. Now The Journey of Natty Gan was released July 17th, 2018 for the Disney Movie Club. I don't think I've ever seen this movie but it is one that I want to check out. Okay, we have two Pooh type movies. Um, we have Pooh, uh, we have Pooh's Grand Adventure, The Search for Christopher Robin, and this right here is for their 20th anniversary, and it was released on Blu-ray July 17th, 2018. A great um, uh, Winnie the Pooh film, and on that same day they released the Piglet, um, Piglet's Big Movie which I've only seen once. But if you enjoy Winnie the Pooh, these are two great ones to have. Okay, a holiday movie A holiday movie that they released is I'll Be Home for Christmas. Now this right here was released for their 20th anniversary and it was released on October the 9th, 2018. 
this right here is a great um, holiday film that if you never checked this one out, definitely check it out. Okay, two big releases that were released recently, uh, a couple of years ago. Um, we got a Goofy movie. So a Goofy movie was released for their 25th anniversary on April 23rd, 2019. It was a big deal to have this one released. A lot of people were um, looking forward to this one. And on that same day, they did um, an extremely goofy movie. This right here was released for um, their 20th anniversary on April 23rd, 2019. I did watch both of these when um, they came out and um, enjoyed both of them. So I'm very happy to have that one, those in my collection. Okay, we have 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. Now this right here was released for the 65th anniversary on June 18th, 2019. We have In Search of the Castaways, um, released June 18th, 2019. We have Black Hole. Now Black Hole was released for their 40th anniversary and it was released on August 13th, 2019. We have George of the Jungle. Now, George of the Jungle was released August 13th, 2019. It's a fun movie. Not the best in the world, but as you can tell, it would be something fun to watch. Okay, another big release that came out is The Scarecrow of Romney Marsh. People were really excited to have this one released. Um, this right here is from Dr. Sin um, and was released back during the Disney Treasure Days. And so a lot of people that missed out on that was really looking forward to having this one um, on Blu-ray. So this right here was released October 8th, 2019. And then, so that was October 8th, 2019. So recently we just received two new um, Disney Movie Club exclusives. So there were no exclusives released in 2020. Um, but we did get some new releases here. We got Valiant. Now Valiant was released May 4th, 2021. Really nice looking artwork. And we also got The Black Cauldron on the same day. So May 4th, 2021, we got The Black Cauldron, which actually does have um, some special features, some bonus extras. So that was a really nice addition to the Disney Movie Club. And from what I understand, there are going to be some more releases um, exclusive to the Disney Movie Club, and I'm looking forward to seeing what those are. Now, I do have some more um, Blu-ray releases that um, Disney Movie Club has done, so I wanted to take time to show you those. So just like they did with the DVDs, they did some with the Blu-rays where they released um, some multi-packs with a different slipcover. So we do have the Aladdin 2 movie collection, which has Aladdin and the King of Thieves and The Return of Jafar. This is the only way to have those movies on Blu-ray. So I'm happy to have this one. We also got a Disney Movie Club exclusive for Cinderella 2, Dreams Come True, and Cinderella 3, A Twist in Time. So those right there did have a wide release as a two-pack, but the Disney Movie Club also put out a special edition with a different slipcover. And then we did get the Disney Halloween collection. We have The Nightmare Before Christmas and Hocus Pocus 2-pack, which has some really nice looking packaging, as you can tell. On the back, it's got the um, embossed spider and a spider web, as you can see. So nice to have this one. And then we did get a limited edition release for The Jungle Book. So when the, um, when the Jungle Book was no longer available, um, Disney Movie Club made that an exclusive. So a different kind of slipcover. And then recently with the acquisition of the Fox titles, we did get some other new exclusives. We got Home Alone and Home Alone 2, two movie collection. Now this right here comes with a Blu-ray, the DVD, and the digital. We did have a wide release of this. Um, that I picked up at Target, and it only came with the Blu-ray and the digital. So I think the only bonus to this was that it came with a DVD. Same kind of slipcover and everything. The only thing different is the logo down there at the bottom. And then we got Ice Age, the three adventure collection with a special slipcover. So it has the Blu-ray, the, the DVDs, and the digital. 
We also got the Prince's Three Movie Collection with Moana Tangled and the Little Mermaid, which is some really nice packaging. And then most recently, we got the Best of Mickey. So this right here comes with Fantasia, Fantasia 2000, and Celebrating Mickey. Really beautiful looking um, slip cover. And this is really the only way to get Fantasia and Fantasia 2000 on Blu-ray at this time. So very nice to have that one in the collection. So those are all of my Disney Movie Club exclusives. Hopefully you've got some of these titles in your collection. I know that um, some people have to go to eBay to be able to find some of these titles. And if, there, if there's some movies that are in this collection that you are interested in, definitely check out eBay because um, I have noticed that there are a lot of good titles that are really inexpensive. Um, now that there's the Disney Plus, um, streaming service a lot of people have put a lot of their disney movie club exclusives on ebay for pretty cheap now some of them do go for some high prices but if you want some of these older obscure titles i think that you might be able to find those pretty inexpensive on, on ebay if you like what you saw here today please give it a thumbs up and share the video if you haven't subscribed to my channel i really appreciate it if you would subscribe if you do subscribe please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time i upload a new video if you haven't found me on my social media accounts i'm on facebook twitter and on instagram and if you'd like to check out what i've been watching you can find me over on letterboxd i do have links below but thanks again for watching and we will see you next time